welcome back to my channel. So excited that you are here. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. I appreciate you. It's Jody Dunn coming at you with my Monday CVS haul, which turned out fantastic. I'm so excited to share it with you. If you are new and you just found the channel, I'm so happy that you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know that you are new right down there? I would love to welcome you and say hello back to you. And if you are already subscribed, I appreciate you so much for coming back to another video. Thank you. I hope you are having a fantastic day. Are you excited about CVS couponing this week? We got a ton of great deals as we always do. So I'm going to take you in the store with me like I normally do. We're going to go over what I decided to pick up, match up what I had in CRTs and coupons along with my needs and wants. We're going to be having a focus on some baby products today because we had a pretty good deal and I wanted to stock up on some things. I want to tell you one thing before we run into the store. I'm going to give you a little challenge today. This is super duper challenging. <laughs> that's why it's called a challenge. So if you choose to accept it, if you don't, that's totally cool as well. But there's one, there's this quote that floats around every now and again. I see it on uh, social media somewhere. And I happened to run across, across it. I had screenshotted it on my phone. So I will put it up on the screen for you. And I thought it would be fun to give you a challenge. Again, if you choose to accept it. Um, because I need this challenge in my life as well. And the quote says... Something like the world already, and I'm going to mess the quote up. I'm just going to pop it up on the screen. Here's my paraphrase of the quote. Uh, the world already has enough critics being an encourager or, or being an encourager in a world that's already full of critics. It's something like that. So here's my challenge for you because this can be very, very hard to do. And... Um, you know I love to talk about gratitude on this channel often, and this is something that I have been working on for years as well, because we all tend to lean towards the negative, no matter what. It's our brains. We got to fight it. We have to make a conscious effort to choose other than the negative. And I love this quote so much because if you look around, even if you look inside yourself in your own life you will find that it is so often that we criticize. And it may be out of a great intent to, like, we don't realize we're criticizing and maybe we're trying to help somebody. Um, but the world definitely does not have enough people in it that encourage. So here's my challenge for you, and it's going to be hard. And if you want to report back, I would love that. I want you to find somebody this week that you can encourage, that you really wanna criticize. I know that might sound weird, but let me give you an example. Let's say you see your friend, or you see your mom, or you see your daughter, or whoever, and the shirt that they are wearing is not flattering. It does not flatter them at all. It really looks terrible on them. Why does Gus have to be barking during this important, important announcement? <laughs> Gus, please. I don't even know what he's barking at out there. Oh, let's just see if we can get through this. And they walk in and you love them. And you want to let them know that that shirt looks horrendous on them because it really does. Again, that's just your opinion, but it, it just doesn't flatter them. And so we have a tendency, especially with the people that we care about and we love, that we want to let them know that something maybe just isn't working with them. When that happens to you this week, I want you to bite your tongue and I want you to go, okay, I want you to say in your mind, I really do not like that shirt on them, but let me find something that I do really love that I can encourage them. I want to give them some encouragement. Okay, I have to find the gratitude right now <laughs> because my dog won't start barking and it's going to drive me crazy. Gus, please. All right, so I want you to say to them, mm. 
you know I don't edit and you know I don't refilm and I'm starting to feel like I need to refilm this. All right, so you really want to tell them that that shirt looks terrible on them, but you're going to refrain because you're not going to add to all of the critics that there already are in the world. Instead, you are going to make a choice to be an encourager and you are going to find something that you love about them, whether it's their shoes, whether their smile is extra bright today. It has to be genuine. I'm not telling you to lie and tell somebody that you like something about them that you don't. No, I really want you to find something that you genuinely love about them, whether it is their physical appearance, whether it is something to do with anything in their life. It doesn't matter. You're going to look at that shirt and you're going to say to yourself, oh my gosh, that shirt is horrible on you. It totally does not flatter you. But your eyes are sparkling today. Your smile is extra bright today. Uh, whatever it may be, you look gorgeous today if that's how you feel. Whatever it may be, I want you to give them some encouragement because the dear Lord, the dear Lord knows the world is filled with all kinds of critics. Go out and be an encourager. I'm telling you, not only is it going to make that person feel amazing that you gave them some type of compliment and encouragement in their life, it's going to make you feel dang good too. So, all right, I just wanted to give you a little Monday challenge. Let's head into CVS and pick up some awesome deals today. If you enjoy the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's go grab some awesome deals. All right, we are in the CVS getting ready to get some awesome deals this week. I am so excited. I checked for the soap, the clearance soap. Uh, my sh They didn't have any on the shelves. So the first deal that we are going for is the CoverGirl. My store's not tagged, but it is on promotion for Spend 18. Earn back a $6 extra buck. And I'm going for the uh, CoverGirl Blurring Serum, which is priced at $19.99. And yes, I picked up that sign I dropped. It was an old sign from the Epic Beauty event that was running. Anyways, I've got two $6 off cover girl serum crts and a six dollar off 20 so that'll bring me down to 199 and i'll earn back a six dollar extra buck making this a 401 money maker all right next deal we're going for is the l'oreal revital lift l'oreal facial care is on promotion for spend 30 earn back a ten dollar extra buck i'm going for the revital lift which is priced at $31.99 in my store. Except for this nighttime one is $36.99, so I swapped it out for the daytime one that's $31.99. I'm gonna use this expired $2 coupon. My store does accept expired coupons, as I know a lot of our stores do, but not all. And then I have two $6 off the Revital Lift CRTs, and I have a five off of 25 L'Oreal Facial Care CRT. So that'll drop me down to $12.99 and I will earn back a $10 extra buck. Plus I spent over 30, so it's just gonna be a nice little freebie after beauty tracking. I asked the manager if they had any of the bigger soft soaps in the back and look what he found me. So he got four of them. I said, I'll take all four. We're gonna run over to the red box and scan this baby and make sure they are on clearance in my store. And they are for 28 cents. I saw Star posted this on Instagram. So, so excited that I was able to find four of these babies. I hope you can find them. All right, next we're gonna go for some really, really cheap uh, contact solution. I just gave Grayson some. So I wanna make sure I have enough stock. The Renew Double Pack is on sale this week for $15.99 and it's giving back a $2 extra buck. And I was just checking the expiration date on this. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick this up. I have a $6 off manufacture coupon on the app. We also have a paper version. I have a $2 instant CRT we all got for the Renew. I have a $2 off when I spend six on Renew and I have a three off contact solution that is all attaching. So that'll drop me down to $2.99 for this dual pack and I'll earn back a $2 extra buck, making it just 99 cents. All right, next up, we're just gonna do a super easy freebie that anybody can do if your store has the Sure deodorant or the Brute deodorant. 
No coupons needed. It's on sale for $2 this week. And when you buy one, you earn back a $2 extra buck. My store does not have the brute, so I'm going to go ahead and pick up the Sure. I'll pay two and I'll earn back two. All right, we're getting some expensive things today, so I got to grab a couple money makers to help offset the cost. So we're going for the Whole Blends, which is on sale this week, two for seven. And if, when you buy two, you are getting back a $3 extra buck. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up. I found some that have like 35% more. These are a little bit bigger bottles. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up these two. And again, I will be using a coupon that expired on Saturday because my store does accept them for $3 off. And then we all got an instant CRT for $2 off when you buy two of the whole blends. That'll bring me down to $2 and I'll earn back a $3 extra buck. Makes these free plus a $1 money maker. It has been over a month since I have done a shave deal at CVS. OMG, we're doing a shave, shave deal today. These Schick products are on promotion for spend 25, earn back a $10 extra buck. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab this Schick Intuition for $13.79. And it also includes the Bulldog products. So I'm going to grab one of these Bulldog moisturizers for $11.99. I found a Peely on it. So, so excited for $2 off. For the Schick Intuition, I have a $4 off CRT. I have no manufacturer coupons for that one. And for the Bulldog, I have two CRTs for $3 off Bulldog Facial Care. And then I also have a $5 off when I spend $20 on Shave Needs. So these two total me $25.78 after my $2 coupon and all those CRTs. It'll bring me down to $8.78 and I will earn back a $10 extra buck, making it a $1.12 money maker. All right, we are in a new store because there were some things I wanted that my other store didn't have. So I thought I would check and see if they had any of the clearance soft soap here or the J.R. Watkins and they do not. My normal store does not carry these more expensive paparazzis. We're gonna get an awesome little promotion on these. Now the regular paparazzi nail polish that's $4.99 are buy two, get the third free. These ones right here, just on this top roll, they're like treatment ones, like the cuticle oils and stuff. These are $4.99 each and these are on promotion for if you buy two, you earn back an $8 extra buck. So these two will total me $9.98. I have a CRT for $3 off when I spend seven on paparazzi nail polish. So that's gonna bring me down to $6.98 and I will earn back an $8 extra buck, making them free plus a $102 money maker. All right, one thing my regular store did not have uh, was those paparazzi and they didn't have any of the Cottonelle. You can also get the big package of Scott, but I am more in need of toilet paper than I am at paper towel right now. So I'm gonna grab this Cottonelle for $10.49 and I have a $3 off when I spend 10 on Cottonelle CRT. And this is on a promotion of spend $20 in certain products and you earn back a $5 extra buck. And the Dawn Power Wash is included. They only had one of the green apple. I was gonna get the regular, but then I saw this one. I don't have any of that one, so I'm gonna grab that one. So these are on sale for $4.99 each. So these three total me $20.47. I'm gonna use these two $1 coupons that we got off the Dawn Power Wash and my $3 CRT. That'll bring me down to $15.47 and I'll earn back a $5 extra buck. So it'd make my cost $3.49 per product. Not a spectacular deal, not bad on the Cottonelle, but we got some money makers to help eat up that cost. Next deal I wanted to do, we're focusing all on baby here on the household deal of spend 30, earn 10. Uh, I just gave Grayson my last draft, so I'm gonna grab this draft for $11.94. And I'm gonna go ahead and use this $3 coupon off of the draft. And then another thing my store did not have was the size of Pampers diapers that I wanted. And they are included in the spend 30, earn 10, and they are on sale two for 20. And this store has the size three. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab two packages of the Pampers diapers for $20. And I have a um, $3 off two digital coupon. So for my Pampers and my draft, I'm at $31.94. 
but last week I got an $8 off when I spend 40 CRT. So I'm just going to go ahead and add the Dawn Power Wash into that deal so that I can use that eight off of 40. So after my two coupons for $3 off and my eight off of 40, it'll drop me down to $17.94 for the spend 30, earn 10, and I will earn back the $10 extra buck. So it'll make my cost $2.64 for each package of Pampers and the draft, which is not bad. And then the last deal, we're looking at some Oral-B toothbrushes. There are a ton of tags up for buy two, earn back a $5 extra buck with a limit of two on the dual pack toothbrushes. But these ones did not have a tag by them, so I took them up to a cashier and had her scan it on her little handheld thing to see if they were included in an extra buck deal because I could not find these online. And they are. So I'm gonna grab four of these, which are priced at $4.99 each. So four of these totals me $19.96. My store does allow me to use up to four like coupons. So I'm gonna go ahead and use three of these $2 off coupons that we just got. And then I have a $2 digital coupon and I have a CRT for $6 off when I buy four and these are attaching. So that's gonna drop me down to $5.96 and I will earn back a $10 extra buck for doing the deal twice. Makes them a $4.04 money maker. All right, this is gonna complete my first CVS haul for this week. Let's head to the kitchen table and go over these receipts and final cost. All right, here we are back at the kitchen table with this CVS haul. I ended up grabbing $186.26 worth of product. So excited for everything I got. It was not a freebie today, but it was a very low cost and I am great with it considering the products that I got. So let's go over these receipts. So the first deal I did was on the, I did the L'Oreal and the CoverGirl. So there is this receipt. There's my L'Oreal for $19.99 and, or my CoverGirl for $19.99 and my L'Oreal. I used that $2 coupon. There's my $6 off the serum CRT, my six off 20, my six off of the L'Oreal Revitalift CRT, my other $6 off CoverGirl, my other $6 off L'Oreal, and my five. Oh, I sent the five off 15 instead of the five off 25 to my card. Well, it doesn't matter, except for... I think the five off 25 is expiring first. Dang it, that's what happens when you send everything to your card. It doesn't matter, it still worked out to be the same math. So I used uh, $14 in extra bucks to pay and a couple of the 2% quarterly extra bucks had a subtotal of 93 cents. And then what I earned back was my $10 extra buck for the L'Oreal Facial Care and my $6 extra buck for the cover girl. So that was awesome. And then I had the manager checking the back for the soap and he found some. I was so excited. Um, I don't, did I put that on this receipt? Yes, I did. Weird thing, sometimes clearance will show up whether you put your number in or not and sometimes it will not. So just beware, those did ring up at 329 until I put my phone number in. And you know, when I'm at self-checkout, I always put my phone number in last. I never put it in first. There's a whole link in the description box with all kinds of tutorials about CVS couponing. And in one of them, I think it's the one titled CVS Hacks, I do have a self-checkout demonstration and I walk you through how to do self-checkout and what order to do everything in. So they ring up at 329. I was like, oh crap, are they, like I scanned them at the red box, you saw it. But I did. it did say price with card and I just didn't pay attention to that. So on this one, I did the whole blends, the sure deodorant, the renew contact solution, and then there's all my soft soap that rang up for 29 cents each. That is so awesome. Let me know if you were able to snag some of those. I considered going, I don't go to CVS until Monday. I considered going yesterday because hand soap does excite me. But I was like, nope, Jody, you're not running around looking for clearance anything. Go on Monday. If you find some, you find some. If you don't, you don't. It's not a big deal. So I got lucky and I found four. So happy. Um, and then there is my Bulldog and the Schick Razor. So only coupons that I used was the $2 Peely that I found in the store for the Bulldog. And what did I have a $3? Oh, my $3 coupon off the whole blends. There's my $6 digital off the Renew. 
and my five off 20 shave needs, my $4 CRT off Schick Intuition, both of my $3 off the Bulldog, my three off the Contact Lens Solution, my two off six Renew, that's the instant coupon for the whole blends and then my instant coupon off of the Renew. So I use $16 and extra bucks to pay plus a couple of quarterly extra bucks. Had a subtotal of 84 cents on this one and I earned back my $3 extra buck for the whole blends, my $2 extra buck for the Sure and my $10 extra buck for the Schick and Bulldog deal, and then my $2 extra buck for the Renew. And then I moved over to the other store because my normal store, I haven't been to the other store in quite a while, but my normal store did not have the Cottonelle that I wanted, and they did not have the diapers that I wanted, nor did they have, they only had one of those, um, which I wasn't really like, if I got those, I got those. If I didn't, I didn't. Um, but it did help me drop my cost down. I really went to the other store for the size of diapers that I wanted. And then I was super excited to grab the Cottonelle and the Paparazzi. So in the next receipt, I did the Cottonelle and I did the Paparazzi. So there's my Cottonelle and my Paparazzi. I only separated this one because I didn't want my 8 off 40 messing up with these two threshold CRTs. So I had no manufacturer coupons here. There's my three off 10 Cottonelle and my three off seven Paparazzi. I used $14 and extra bucks to pay, had a subtotal of 47 cents. And what I earned on this transaction was my $8 for purchasing two of the Paparazzi. Now this deal does include, it includes these nail treatments and it includes Paparazzi Cosmetics which I didn't even look at this store. My normal store does not have any paparazzi cosmetics. But when I was looking online, it had like eyeshadow brushes, eyeshadow kits. It had a whole bunch of stuff. So anyways, pretty awesome deal for that one. And remember, you do not have to purchase everything in one transaction unless they are those weird tiered promotions. So I only purchased the Cottonelle. Um, so I was going to show you on my receipt right here. So it tells you that I purchased $10.49 towards the household deal. I need to spend another $9.51 to get that $5 extra buck. And I can do this at any day um, of the week, as long as I did it before Saturday. So you don't have to do it all in one transaction. So then in the next transaction, I did the Pampers, the Draft, and the Dawn. So there are my Pampers, my Dreft, and the Dawn Power Wash. Can you believe that is regularly $8.29? Holy moly. That stuff is good and I like it, but I wouldn't pay $8.29 for it. There's my Dawn Power Wash coupons and my Dreft coupon. My Pampers coupon came off. There's my eight off of 40 and I used $25 and extra bucks to pay for this. Had a subtotal of 92 cents. I then met my requirement for the spending 20 on these products. So I earned my $5 extra buck. And then I earned my $10 extra buck for spending 30 on the household products. And I went for baby products. And then I saw that this store had those. Um, so I went ahead and finished up my shopping with that transaction. So those are priced at $4.99 each. I used those three $2 coupons, my $2 digital came off, and then my six off four, used $5 in extra bucks to pay, had a subtotal of 96 cents, and I earned back my $10 extra buck for purchasing them twice, for doing the deal twice. So $186.26 worth of product here. I used $74 in extra bucks to pay for this, plus had subtotals of $4.12. So my cost was $78.12. I just showed you $66 in extra bucks that I earned back. And I spent $68.96 towards beauty, but I was only like $3 away, $3.20 it says, away from my next beauty buck. So within 48 hours, I will earn back another $9 extra buck, which means I earned $75 in CVS money from this haul that cost us $78.12. So it makes my cost $3.12. I will take that for two Pampers, for the Cottonelle, 
for the Dawn Power Wash for the draft. I love this haul. And really like a dollar of my cost was the clearance hand soaps, which I was super happy that I found and was able to grab. So I think it worked out pretty dang good. Like I said, not a freebie, but pretty darn close to free. I'll take it. I would love to hear any awesome deals you are excited about at CVS. Feel free to drop them down in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Hope you have a great day. I'm going to see you again soon. Bye.